What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and today we've got kind of a lighter video here um, for the update. Nothing in terms of the patch. There's no patch notes, no nothing like that. And so I'm going to go ahead and just cover the Pearl Shop update, the upcoming changes to certain Pearl items, and Hot Time event. So let's get into this. As always, if you want to read these for yourself, the links will be in the top of the description. Um, so, Pro Shop update for May 5th. It's an event. It's just really a sale um, for these items. So, we have the Super Premium Outfit. It gives you a Premium Outfit box times 3, Artisan Memory times 50, Advice of the Volks plus 40, Crone Stones, 200 of them, and Volks Cry times 10. It will be on sale for 30% off for 8,715 pearls, which I think is a little, like, a shade under so if yeah we'll say at full price i won't give the 10 percent discount so if it's 100 bucks uh, that's probably gonna cost you like 80 probably 85 87 i mean it's 10,000 pearls for 100 bucks so 87 dollars and 15 cents is about your value for that you can buy 10 per family and there's no scheduled reset for the purchase restrictions next we have spring trip pack so we got premium outfit box one Value pack 30 days times 1, Artisan Memories times 10, uh, Secret Book of Old Moon times 1, Item Collection Increase Scrolls 60 minutes times 10, Vibrant Peach Flower Drought times 5, Heartwarming Spring Drought times 5, and a 10% discount coupon for the Pearl Shop. 3,745 pearls uh, is what that's going to run you. About 38 bucks, 37 and a half bucks. Restriction is one per family and it resets every Monday. Seven days uh, for the coupon to use and three days from time of purchase is when the registration period expires. So this runs till May. Actually, this doesn't have an end. It doesn't have an end to the sale. I was going to say how many Monday resets does it have, but it doesn't actually say. Okay, so next we have the double Rakshande, Rakshande pack. So you'll be able to, this, this was like the Sage Witch patch pack. Um, for 5100 which is 25% off, you get item collection increase 60 minutes times 5, a secret book of Old Moon one day times 1, and then you can choose two of uh, Mewa, Witch, and Mystic Rakshande um, premium sets. Next is Fantastic Young Dragon, Fantastic Young Dragon Surprise times 1, and then you can select one of Master Enhancer's Rarities, Dream Horse Training Rarities, or Magic Crystal Rarities. It's 2,000 pearls. Um, cannot be registered in the central market and not for available for sale in Belgium and the Netherlands. Uh, so fantastic young dragon surprise items you can get. You have a 2% chance of getting the tier 1 limited, an 8% of the tier 4 limited, 30% um, at the tier 3 limited, and 60% at the tier 2 limited. Um, that's actually fairly decent. You're pretty much automatically going to get a tier 2 unless you just have the worst luck ever. And you have a fairly good shot at a tier 4, tier 3. Um, why is this Why is this minimized? Hold on, let me click these open real quick. Okay, so I'm not going to read all these. I'll leave them up. The Magic Crystal Rarities, uh, possible items. Highest up here is Valor, Precision, Swiftness, Armor. And then down at the bottom, we've got the Gin ones. So that's actually interesting. So I don't know. Let's see. I'm not actually sure how the Fantastic Young Dragon Surprise comes, um, but, oh, this is the rarities. What am I talking about? So, Master Enhancer's rarity. Okay. I'm an idiot. Um, for the Dream Horse training rarities, it uh, looks like you have about 12% at 6 items and then 7% uh, at 4. The Enhancer's Black Gem, 20%. Vice of the Volks, plus 45 down here. Pure Magical Blackstone, Chrome Stones, Vice of the Vol. Eh, not too bad. Herculean Strength Pack. Four, um, Flint, uh, Finto's Fresh Juice times 40, weight limit plus 250, and weight limit plus 300, uh, 4,160 pearls, 20% off. Once purchased, the weight increase is bound to the character that bought it. Not available for characters that have already purchased the weight increase separately. Purchase restrictions, one per character. There is no scheduled reset. Maid slash Butler, two plus one pack, so I'm assuming that's two for the, or three for the price of two. So that's not bad. You can take it. You can make your choice of three of those for 2,400 pearls. Lucky Fortune. Um, I think this is just a combination. Looks like is that supposed to be a plus plus five per family resets every Monday, or is that 15? 
I can't tell if that's supposed to be like plus five or I'm going to go with 15 and then it resets every Monday if you want to get a ridiculous amount of blessed message scrolls, item collection increase scrolls, and blessing a canvas of 1250 pearls. Enhanced Old Moon, similar thing, 1250 resets every Monday. Fairy Radiant Birth, uh, similar thing, a little more expensive, 2000 comes with uh, Layla's Petals times 10, Thea's Orbs times 10, and Sweet Honey Wine times 2. And then we have Fairy Radiant Birth, uh, Ornette's Dark Honey Wine times 5, and Sweet Honey Wine times 1, 520, same restrictions. Uh, and then we have the second sale. So I don't know if these are brand, these are brand new, I guess. They're considered brand new, even though some of these items aren't brand new. They're considered a brand new event. And then down here we have the items that are going on sale. Black Spirit Essence times 2. Mount Skill Change Coupons, you get 9 Mount Skill Change Coupons and 3 Dream Horse Training Surprises, 1500 There's the possible items you can get from the Dream Horse. It looks like 2, 4, 8 at 11.5% and, and then 2 at 4%. Elian's Tears times 11, so you get double, so it's 22 and it's half off, 500 um, Energy Tonic, same deal, 22 of those. And then we have the... Only brand new things. We got the Maywa Rakshande Premium Set and the Mystic Rakshande Premium Set. So what I'm going to try to do here, I haven't actually tried this yet. I want to show these things um, on Black Desert, so I have to log in because I logged out. But once we get done, I'll go in and we'll look at the Maywa Rakshande and the Mystic Rakshande uh, Premium Sets. So let's switch over. I'll be more prepared in the future. I'm sorry about this. I decided like right now while I'm recording this that why not switch over and we'll show it. So I just got to log back into my Sork and we'll be good to go. But next we have the upcoming changes to the Pearl items. Um, we want to inform you of the changes coming uh, with the update on May 12th. So that is next week. So the names and icon colors of certain classes underwear will be changed to match their actual appearance. The name of Sorcerer's new basic underwear will change to new deep black underwear. The name of Mystic, uh, this is just changes to the names of underwear. Nothing too exciting there. I don't think I need to read all of those. But obviously, link will be in the description if you do. Next, we have the Hot Time event. Not anything crazy here, but it's starting to heat up as another Hot Time is coming your way. Enjoy extra combat and skill XP or enhance your gathering experience with extra hard and sharp black crystal shards. So this will begin... Um, okay, so this began last week. I don't know why this is, but... After the 28th uh, of April maintenance, and it runs through the next week's maintenance on Wednesday, um, you'll get, so the weekday hours, so it, it, it's only certain hours, but weekdays, there's seven hours from 5 p.m. to 11.59 p.m. Grimmage Mean Time, so this is Pacific, so it's noon to 7 Eastern, which is, I'm, that's some terrible hours, or what am I, not noon, oh my gosh, it is. <laughs> 6 to 1 a.m. I just went the wrong way to do the time zone. Okay. <laughs> 6 to 1 a.m. for the Eastern time zone. Um, and then the weekend, it runs from Friday to Monday. So that's nice. And then let's see here. This is the hard and black crystal shards on all servers. Uh, that's the increase. Same time frames. Actually, the time frames for the weekend are actually it's one hour. Starts one hour later, ends one hour later. I think for every, yeah, for for both the weekend and the weekdays. Um, and so the event known as Hot Time Combat XP effects won't apply to characters below level 50. However, Hot Time Skill EXP effects does not have character level restrictions. Pretty much, then we have a bunch of terms and service things here. So let me switch over to BDO here. So we're going to switch over to BDO. My, I play it on two monitors because obviously I play the console, so it's not on my PC monitor. So you're gonna have to look at like the side of my head for a second here. Um, so let's go to apparel, outfits, and we had the Maywa and the Mystic. So Rakshande. I mean, it's actually it's not bad. I I think I'm gonna like it on Maywa more than I'm gonna like it on Mystic. But that's actually that's not terrible. It reminds me of the, the Desert Sorceress outfit from um, Dark Souls. Uh, but let's see here. Then we have Mystic and the Rakshande. That's yeah, not bad. Uh, Mystic was never my favorite character. That stance with this outfit looks kind of weird. But yeah, that's the two new brand new outfits. 
Uh, that's going to do it, guys. A little bit short video, not too much to go on here, um, or not too much going on here this week. Hopefully, we'll get some new updates next week, uh, maybe a cool new event or something like that. I know some of the events end the 12th, so we'll see what, what we get next week. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Um, check tonight. No Black Desert video. It's going to be an idle GOG, but then we'll have Black Desert tomorrow. Um, I have them all set up to record. Um sork and nova so we'll have videos coming out on that probably tomorrow will be nova and then the next day will be sork uh since i did back-to-back -back novas and the back-to-back -back sorks i'll probably try to alternate them now so that's not the same content every day and i have time to get prepped for the next video but uh yeah that's gonna do it guys i'll catch you guys later peace